In today's video, we are going to learn how to edit any block in two different ways. One is by using block editor, another one using by block edit in the place. Welcome back to your old channel, Cat to Correct. Before proceeding this video, we would like to request you to subscribe our channel so can we can keep creating such a beautiful and useful content for you. On your computer screen, you can see there is a block of home, electric power and cooking stove. This is the block if you want if we want to edit this stove. We can double click. If you double click, then when your window will open, edit block definition. We will click on the click on the home, and we will press the OK open on our screen. By clicking on the OK, we will transfer to another screen that is block editor, in which we can edit your our block like each and every object like block. I am sharing this another. By mistakenly done or it's I don't want to see this extra burner. So I am selecting this and deleting this. Whatever I don't want, I deleted this. After deleting, I will go in the right side of my computer screen and I will select on close block editor. By clicking on this, there will another window will open that will ask you save the changes or, or discard the changes. I will click on the save the changes. Save the changes. Now you can see there is a changes which we made by going in block editor. This will start. Sometimes we required to change the block without going anywhere, without going to in block editor. Like this, this is the basin. I want to edit this basin, but don't want to because if I will double click and go to the block editor, I will not know the reference line of any of my drawings. So no, so avoiding this, we will not use this method. We will use like we will click on the basin and then right click on that object. Then you will see block editor, block editor which we use by block editor going to through the block window. Another option here you can see is edit block in place. I will click on this, the same block they will ask which to edit. I will select on the basin and click OK. Now you can see the basin is highlighted and other, or other lines are faded. It means these other lines are we can't change, we can do the changes in only that highlighted lines. Now I by using the other side lines are for reference only. By using this method I can stretch my basin like I want to use this basin, increase the basin size, I will select this and I will take a point and I will keep nearby this. By this method I use all other drawings for my reference purpose and I keep and, and we can keep and we can do the changes in our block. Now after doing all the changes, we will go to the right side of our window and click on the edit re reference and I will select, we will select on the save changes. By save changes, they will ask all the will be save or to cancel, we will press on OK because we want to save the changes. By clicking, you can see the basin size increased and the reference was line as per our reference line and the block we have not exploded, we have changed the block. By this way you can change your blog in your drawing only. If you enjoy this video and learn something, please like this video. Thanks for subscribing our channel. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat.